this is my concern. Like it feels too much like you're trying to prove something instead of just living it. You know, every other photograph is the two of you kissing, the two of you hugging. With age comes wisdom, and Jane Fonda may have predicted the end of Benefer 2.0. I think it's better to be older. Life gets easier. Jane's words of concern over Jennifer Lopez's rekindled romance with Ben Affleck is back in the spotlight. After J.Lo filed for divorce from Ben on Tuesday, exactly two years after the pair tied the knot. You can't plan your life. That's not how it is. And you have to just be willing to go with what happens. Jane? Yeah, is this Jennifer? It is. Hi. Oh, hi, sweetheart. Oh, thanks for calling. First of all, I want you to know that uh, I, I don't entirely know why, but I feel invested in you and Ben. <laughs> I really, really, really want this to work. The moment going down in Jen's The Greatest Love Story Never Told documentary. The 86-year-old actress not mincing words when expressing her doubts. This is my concern. Like, it feels too much like you're trying to prove something instead of just living it. You know, every other photograph is the two of you kissing, the two of you hugging. Um, That's us living our life. Jane and Jennifer first connected on the set of their 2005 film, Monster in Law. Let's get some backbone. She's smart, she's talented. And in her doc, Jen opens up about their close relationship. She's very protective of me. And commonalities in love, considering Jane has been married three times. Isn't I really funny? looked up to her, obviously, as an amazing actress, but also for what she stood for in her life, and also that she kind of got beat up in the press. And we kind of are similar when it comes to love. We're thinking. trying to get some Can you see if we can get in the papers? I'm trying to get <laughs> could I, could I? When Shen and I broke up for the catalyst for that was this massive amount of scrutiny around our private life. Speaking of publicity in the doc, Jane also brings up Ben's viral photo moments, including at the 2023 Grammys, where it looked like he was upset or bored. I get real scared, you know, though, when all that shit about the, the Grammys and he looked on it. It's like, know, oh it's my so God, what's happening? Nothing, nothing. nothing. He was like, it's like I've become the symbol of the beleaguered man. <laughs> A source tells ET the couple's official split was a long time coming. Ben and Jen had been miserable in their marriage for months. This is her fourth divorce, so this is not a new process to her. In regards to Jen's filing, our source adds, once the honeymoon stage wore off, they both felt frustrated in their relationship. Quote, Ben wanted to believe that certain things had changed, but when he saw signs that they hadn't, it felt like he had been there before. 